Well, good morning. Listen, I've gotten a lot of feedback on the uh, video that I did about the man that boarded the bus to confront the bullies that were uh, bullying his little girl, and now he's being punished for it. Uh, every single feedback I got were people that were applauding the man and saying they would do the same thing and would do it again, uh, regardless of the consequences, because it's the right thing to do. I just saw something that absolutely turned my stomach, just totally burned me up. That's why I'm doing this little video. This is how far we have sunk. We've reached the point that we've let the bullies take over the schools, and we've got to do something about it. Uh, that's my question, is what can we do? I personally think we need to, what, pass legislation or something protecting teachers and principals so they are allowed to stop this sort of situation. They'll once again be allowed to teach for one thing, but they can also stop this from happening. It happens in schools more than anywhere else. It begins in kindergarten. Go to a kindergarten and watch. Some kids are just born bullies. They pick on the weaker kids, the, the nice kids, the ones that don't fight back. They just do. It's up to the adults to teach these little brats that that is wrong. But they're no longer allowed to do so. you got these blood-sucking attorneys out there that have free reign. What they say goes. In other words, you have someone discipline a child, and these attorneys can take the smallest little incident, blow it into some horrendous situation, and cost someone their life savings. So what do these people do? They turn their back, they ignore it, and then you wind up with tragedy. And even if you don't wind up with the tragedy, you wind up with all these kids that are being bullied all the way through school, and when you are, you simply don't perform. That's all there is. It seems like nothing a lot of times. This ear flicking, pushing them to lockers, name calling, sounds like fun, don't it? Well, it's not. When it goes on and on and on, it's devastating. I hate bullies. And it needs to stop. They're just people, and people need to be taught. Kids are no longer raised. They're just turned loose to raise themselves. That's just sad. Now, here's the situation that I saw a while ago that really turned my stomach. The girl that just hung herself. It just happens that in her school, there have been four kids commit suicide in four years from bullying. It must be really rampant in that school, and it's pretty obvious that it is because her parents said that she was so bullied and so picked on, she saw no way out, no one would do anything about it, it wasn't going to stop, so she came home and hung herself. Here's the kicker. At her wake, one of the bullies, a girl, shows up at her wake in a prom dress laughing at the situation. My God, people, what's going on? Have these kids lost all concept of reality, what they're doing, what they've done? We've got to give these teachers and principals and bus drivers authority to stop this crap. Legislation or what? You tell me. I don't know. But if we've sunk that low, where are we going from here? I hate it for those people. That, 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 that's one of the saddest things I've ever heard. And I don't know how they didn't grab that girl and just pull her head off. Simple commentary. Y'all think about it. Have a good day.